824 on a Saturday. So of course, Halloween it's last week and might be over, but a good crime thriller movie never goes out of style, right? This morning we're talking to a Detroit native and Emmy nominated producer, Mr. Sam Logan, all about his new film. It's called An Intrusion. Sam, it's so good to see you. Hey, Michael, thanks for taking the time this morning to talk to me. Absolutely. Anytime. And here's the thing, Sam, like I love, I particularly love when I see, you know, Metro Detroit folks doing big things. That's what you and your team are doing. Tell me real quick a little bit more about this, uh, an intrusion. What's this movie about? Wow. Uh, well, intrusion, it's, it's an amalgam of multiple genres and subgenres. It's a crime thriller, but there's also character drama in it. It's, it's an edge of your seat thriller. It's got, I mean, maybe a dash of horror in it too. Um, especially some of the horrible things that happen and <laughs> horrible choices the characters make. So it does get a little scary at times, but uh, the movies essentially are, you know, on the surface, you might think it's a basic stalker thriller, but it's not. There's sort of uh, there's a social message underneath the film. The main character, the patriarch of the movie played by Dustin Prince, sort of, uh, you know, makes a couple bad choices and then they follow him into the third act. Um, but I, I shout out honestly to everyone in Detroit that helped make this movie happen. Uh, Chief of Police of Lake Orion, Harold Rossman, Chief of Police of Holly Village uh, and, and, and all those guys, Jerry Narsh, you know, Jerry Walker over in Holly too. Um, and all the other communities we filmed in, everyone was really, bl and Milford and downtown Detroit, people will recognize the Penobscot building. There's Jerry right there, he makes a cameo. Oh, we got a great awesome. cast, Scout Taylor Compton. Scott Taylor Compton from Halloween, uh, Gilchrist, uh, you might recognize Keir Gilchrist from uh, from Atypical and It Follows, Billy Boyd there from Lord oh, of the Rings. Lord of the, Rings. Uh, I mean, the, the, the fact that I got to even work with, the fact that I got to even work with one of my favorite hobbits, I'm like, oh my God, like this is kind of cool, right? <laughs> <laughs> so this is what producing all about. So uh, I love of it. So I got a shout out to Nick Holland, our screenwriter and director. Nick Holland wrote an amazing story. Really oh amazing man, story. you know, so we're, we're watching the preview right now, Sam, and I mean, this it already looks awesome. So what you're telling me is that for folks that are watching this specific movie, they'll recognize some Metro Detroit landmarks in here too while they're watching, right? Yes, yes. So you will recognize the Penobscot, you will recognize, uh, it, honestly, the village of Lake Orion and Charlie's still on Maine and Milford, and you, you'll recognize all these spots, even in the rural areas, the suburban areas, and everywhere that you visit people uh, uh grace kiros american coney island thank you for letting us take over one night oh <laughs> so, man Sam, um, they're, yeah. they're they're loving it that's what I, i'm sure of it and here's the thing so what from what i understand you guys have of course a a red carpet pr premiere i believe that's happening next thursday on the 11th of november and then next you guys thursday. are having like a big nationwide viewing right Right, so the, the, the movie opens up uh, nationwide on Thanksgiving weekend uh, in all mediums, theatrical, day and day, uh, DVD, Blu-ray, uh, iTunes. However, if you're a Michigander, you're a Detroiter, you want to join us, hang out with the cast yeah. and crew. Thursday, November 11th at Imagine Novi. From, uh, there's an 8 and 8.05. You can go to Imagine's website or box office to get those tickets for, 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 for the 11th. There, there's some tickets left in the uh, for the 8 and some tickets left for the 8.05. Both show times have access to us. We're going to be there, and, the, and, the, and you know, obviously for Q&A and all that. Uh, and then there's going to be an after party at Beerhead. Thank you, Yusuf. We love you, man. At oh. Beerhead across the street. We're, we're shutting that down, too. <laughs> so we're going to have an after party that goes from 10, 10 p.m. Are you in my I want to know, you bring Charlie with you because oh, you're going to need yeah. a lawyer with you. So bring Charlie with you. So L listen, Sam, <laughs> anywhere there's a party you're need a in lawyer. Metro Detroit, you... Charlie is at that party. He was at one last night, for example. So, hey, he... and we want to know where our uh, invite honestly, was, Sam. Honestly, you are like the best no. dress journalist. <laughs> Both of you guys. Both of you guys are like the best dress journalist, male journalist I've ever seen. Like anytime I'm like, these guys do not address. Look at me, I need a tie. I mean, you know, when yeah. when you're working next to Charlie and then you're working next to folks like Huel Perkins, like you gotta step up your A game. That's all I gotta say. Plus these are Michigan colors. You know, we had a big game <laughs> taking place today too. So this looks like a lot I'm, of fun. I'm a Wolverine. Uh, I'm a Wolverine. Yeah. Heck yeah. Go blue, man. Go blue, Sam. Go. Yeah. So real quick, just to wrap Class up. Class of 07. Uh, <laughs> I love it. Just to wrap up here, Sim, so again, on Thursday, next Thursday, 11th, is when you guys have that premiere. All of your co-stars are going to be there, too. Again, from Halloween, you got the folks from uh, Lord of the Rings trilogy, you know, the, the big stars in there. Sam, I love what you're doing. Thanks for representing Detroit so well.
Thank you so much, Michael, and uh, God bless all of you. And for anyone who misses it, let me know. I'll get him a little gift set with the DVDs and Blu-rays or something. Anyone in the studio. Listen, Sam, I love it. Keep doing what you're doing. You're welcome back on Fox 2 anytime. We appreciate your time.